Hello everyone, welcome back on Mr. Mungu channel. Guys, I'm Ram Singh, Unity game developer, YouTuber and blogger. So friends, now I am back in Photon series. So in last series, what we have done is just we have create a Photon series in which we are able to get the room list. We are able to get the player list and we are able to join, play with the friends and we are able to die. So now what I have decided that most of you were requesting that you need a photon voice uh, like uh, in which a player can communicate through their voice. So in this tutorial I am going to implement the photon voice that how you can chat with your friend that uh, that will be implemented in your game. So what you need to continue this, this tutorial that uh, you can if you have follow my uh, my series of photon pun two so you can start from there i am just starting from after my last tutorial but if you have not completed this this tutorials so what you have to do is that at least you have to done done that you are able to join a room with your player okay so after that you can continue because photon voice work after the joining any room with the players so let's start the 2d video if you're new on the channel make sure subscribe the channel and don't forget to like subscribe and share and drop in the comment box if if you have any question and if you want to ask something so let's start the 2d video okay so what we are going to implement is that is the voice for pun two so this is the ba basic concept that is the what you need means uh, earlier there was a photon voice one but now it is pun yani ki photon voice two is exist and you can see that voice client state can be automatically synchronized with the pun client state so what we are going to use is that the main use case in mind we will use the player like character avatar we are insta instantiating inside the room and we will use the 3d positions like there will be a, there will be a special that you will use and then we will use the recorder and speaker a speaker will be help you to just speak and recorder will be record the sound and then after the sum threshold it will send on the network so earlier you were using the photon view now we will use the photon voice view so we will explain everything so we will use photon voice network this is the singleton class one scene there must be one photon voice network basically what it does is that it transmit your voice on the network okay so we'll, we will use it and these are the things that you can just check it out what is the use of it and as i told you that we will use the photon voice view so i will going i'm going to implement it so these are the steps i have written that first we will step one what we are going to do is photon voice manager we need where we are going to create our room so let's do it to go in scene and there is a game like in game after joining room from lobby we will able to play the game so here is our script so just i'm going to create one game object name is photon voice manager and what we are going to add so before we add something what we have to do is that we have to go on the asset store okay, so directly you can search photon voice 2 so just i am getting photon voice 2 and what you have to do is just download if you have not downloaded and import it okay so just we have to import everything and photon voice view a very simple way to implement the voice chat because it is a very complicated thing on there is a photon voice and if you want to explore so just you can explore like uh, change voice photon voice labs photon voice apis there is also provided the demo so you can just check out the demo like there is a demo voice pun scene so 
so if you want to explore so you can just explore it and there are in resources there are players so you have to just put these players and you can see that how they have implemented like you see they have photon voice view and they are also somewhere utilizing some uh, scripts so this thing it is a little complicated when you are doing first time so just remove it and let's back to our game that i will show you that how we are going to implement it on voice manager now what we have to use we have to use photon voice network so in photon voice network means basically it's transmit our data what it need it need primary recorder so we have to add recorder so now we have recorder so first thing that you have to pass that recorder to primary recorder and don't destroy on load and uh, here we have to enable few things like transmit enable and here is one more thing that is detect okay so what it does it when you speak something so it detect and uh, after some threshold it send the data on the network okay what i need to know we have completed that step one that we have added photon voice network we have added the recorder step two we have to work on the player so where is our player so our player is basically when you when you instantiate some player on network so you have to put inside the resources so here is player prefab so just push put inside the hierarchy and just open it and i don't know how hierarchy your is but now i am creating one game object that is the speaker and on this game object we have to add one component that is the speaker okay when you add a speaker so by default you get one audio source and if you want to perform 3d effect like uh, your game will you play in the 3d and you want that your sound go in all direction you he able to hear the sound in 3d mode so just you have to spatial blend in one it will be one so it will be so the 3d effect okay now we have added the speaker and uh, on the player what we have to use that we have to use the photon voice view so on photon voice view what it ask it ask for a speaker so just drag and drop the speaker and then you have to do some check marks like auto create recorder if not found on and use primary recorder on okay so we have just completed create the game object with the speaker and we have added the speaker we have completed step 2 step 3 now what we need we need audio listener so by default when you create any scene you get you get a audio listener on camera okay so at a one time in one scene there must be one audio listener okay but you be you have to be careful like in my case when i play my scene so for my means photon view is mine if if i have a local pair so that camera holder will be on but for a remote player like if remote player is generating here so their camera holder will be off so what will happen is that my audio listener will be on so you have to take care that you are not uh, just deactivating your a camera if you, you are deactivating so you have to just add audio listener on some game object but in one scene there must be one audio listener so hope you understand what i'm trying to say so now we have also complete the audio listener audio listener steps okay what we need now that if you are running this application on the windows so you don't need any kind of permission 
but if you are running this application on the android so you need a permission of mic so that you can speak something so what you have to do for that i am just creating one folder inside the script that is the voice chat okay inside voice chat i have to i'm just dropping one script that help you to give a mic permission and then i'm just dropping this script and what this script is let me explain just open this script let's see what is the script basic script is that we are doing for android platform and just simply what we are doing we are checking that if we are in the android so first we are checking that permission had used authorized permission for which permission we are checking the microphone permission so if permission is not allotted so at that time we are just requesting user permission microphone this is the just basic permission in android so what we have to do is just if you are dropping this script in this game like game so first when you will join the room it will ask permission but at that time it will not work means you will not able to chat with your friends you have to just restart the application so to avoid this thing what we have to do is that we have to go in lobby and on photon manager there is a script so let me create one that is the permission okay and mic permission helper override the player prefs and delete it after completing all steps so just we have to go in the lobby and before we play game what we have to do is just uh, we have to follow one more step that i have not mentioned here so just you have to go on your photon dashboard so you have uh, if you have not log in yet so just log in it and then go inside the your dashboard and you have to create one new application because every time when you add any photon voice so what you have to create one new application and there you have to choose voice and you can give 3d multiplayer voice okay and now you can create it now we have created one voice application that is here voice and here you can get a api id that we get in last time also so just copy it and then you have to go window and here you can say photon voice so you have to just go in the highlight servers and here you can get api id voice so, so just put there and control s and then you have to made you have to create one build for your android device and one will be run here so let's see how it's working you can see that in my phone it's asking for permission when i opening opening the application so just open it play here and just enter some name login and uh, now we are clearing if we will get any errors so create room so for this we are using test player number two create room okay so now we have created room and we have joined so i am using my device and room list and just i am joining okay so now i have joined you can see there are two player so let me click on the player and let's see what's happening so right now we are on in the game connecting voice client we are connected joining voice room we are just joined through the photon voice okay okay so in device i have also hello 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 so you can see so you can see 
वी आर एबल टू हियर द माई वॉइस द माई वॉइस इन सिस्टम इन सिस्टम वो फिफ्टी डिट मैन फिफ्टी डिट मैन सो थैंक यू एवरी वन थैंक सो दिस वॉज माई टूटोरियल एंड होप यू इन्जॉय इट एंड आई रियली थैंक यू फॉर योर लव एंड सपोर्ट योर कमेंट रियली मोटिवेट मी टू डू मच मोर टूटोरियल्स एंड फॉर माई हिंदी ऑडियंस जस्ट आई हैव अपडेटेड इन इंग्लिश my english is not so fluent so just i try to make tutorials so i think we should start uh, our challenges to face like english is my challenge so i'm i just started to face and improve so that's thing same thing with you you, you should also start to just watch tutorials in english and, and just uh, learn much more english so that you can face any interview you can just communicate to over the world okay so that's it for today video and if you uh, want to support me on patreon so you can just pet, uh, support me on patreon if you want to join on youtube so you can just join and that will help me to do more tutorials so thank you so much for watching have a good day see you in next tutorial and in next tutorial what we are going to do is that we are going to create some ui stuff for photon voice okay so i will see you in next tutorial bye bye take